Minnesota health officials looking for a silver lining in the spread of the Corona Omicron variant say they hope it can be found in declining intensive care hospitalizations for COVID-19. That figure fell from 374 in mid-December to 255 on Friday. The decline temporarily eases pressure on hospitals as they brace for the wave of Omicron infections. Despite its rapid spread, health officials are hoping the variant will continue to produce at a lower rate of severe COVID-19 cases. Only 18% of Friday's COVID-19 hospitalizations involve patients in intensive care. That's the lowest rate since last March. Today, the state reported 44 new COVID-19 related deaths, along with 10,810 new coronavirus cases. The seven day rolling average for case positivity has now reached a new record at 16.6%. In the Lakeland viewing area, there were 325 new cases. Beltrami County had the most with 58. Crowan County reported 55. Itasca County had 30. And Polk County with 28 new cases in today's report. Also, new data from the state is showing age-adjusted rates of coronavirus-related hospitalizations and deaths remain more than 10 times higher among unvaccinated Minnesotans than vaccinated Minnesotans. The data also suggests that booster shots are paying off in people who experienced reduced immunity after their initial shots. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.